get ready to discover the underground strategies for making real money and creating a life of passion and reward in real estate. It's hardcore. It's no BS. It's Agent on Fire. I'm Casey and my daddy is a rock star. Welcome to Agent on Fire. This is Mike Costigan, the Agent on Fire. And today look at you and I'm going to tell you to get some listings because working buyers, you're just going to always be running scared from the business every day that you wake up. It's horrifying. And I'm going to teach you how to make this money so that, I don't know, you're not the guy that's handing me my little 3D glasses as I'm walking in to watch a horror flick. That's a shit life. You should be making a lot of money in real estate. It is the easiest business to make money. You just got to learn that the way to do it is by using people's houses, not by letting people use your gas and jumping in your car with their kids and their sticky fingers and dirty ass shoes. So I'm going to show you how to do that. I'm going to give you a little something free. It's my gift to you. I'm handing this to you. It's a little sheet of seven bullet pointed ways that you can just easily, quickly, simply go out today and start getting listings really quickly, 30 minutes or less, and charging more commission. Yeah, up your fee, uh, take whatever your competitor charges and charge a percent or two more, whatever the hell you want to charge more. Just charge more. You can do it. It's easy. So uh, I want to get on to this. I want to get on to a little horror. Look, she's a fire breather, smashing tall buildings as she wades through the center of town. You got one shot to land your perfectly placed arrow through the heart of the great Zillow monster or you're doomed forever. Yeah, hardly. Right? This fear being spread about the Zillow monster swallowing up the real estate business is a mere horror story depicting carnage of death and bloody streets made up of fucking agents running scared. Right? It's this big monster tromping on the backs of agents and in order to get to safety amongst the chaos. And it's a load of bullshit. We're not under attack. We, meaning me and my Agent on Fire Blaze newsletter readers and you who's here learning this stuff, you know it and I know it. We're not under attack because we know how to get listings. The ones who are under attack and by all means are going to get killed are the people who are relying on buyers to make their business survive or who don't know how to get a shit ton of listings. Look, it's hype at its finest. This latest dose of fear mongering is designed... uh, Designed to get you behind, the, get you to read behind the headlines. That, that, that's all it is. It's fear mongering. It's just crap. Hear me now. There will always be a place for a full service listing agent. Always. And in order to be a provider of that, you got to deliver what a seller will not and can not do for themselves. The Zillow monster will change the way that segments of the markets behave, but she won't devour the industry for the powerful listing agent. Can't do it. Guys like me, for example. Look, we will always take the lazy man's option of hiring somebody who will do everything for us and we'll pay handling for it because we know that leverage creates freedom. I like freedom. I love freedom. So don't think in my mind that my kind People like me will ever in a Zillow yin years run away from self-service. We don't like things like pumping our own gas. We don't like Walmart. We don't like self-checkouts. We don't like cleaning our own houses. We don't like going to barbershops versus being pampered at the fucking salon by some hot little chick. We don't like anything else than anything less than like front row center seats at concerts. Right? The pampering list goes on. And, and look, well, wow, this we talk may sound like selfish, arrogant bullshit. I'm sorry, it, it's not. We just understand leverage and the joys it brings to life. And we'll happily pay for that instead of some discount bullshit offered by some huge company. And our homes aren't exactly the worst listings for you. I mean, the commissions you can earn, they're really not pennies to throw in the freaking fountain at the mall. So instead of wasting your day Scared of these fairy tale monsters, reality is that you should be figuring out how to attract the non cheapo sellers. I mean, get the people who will be the lifeblood of real estate agents through the good times and the bad times all the fucking times, right? My Agent on Fire Blaze readers are already learning to be the 100 foot tall monsters of their markets. And if you want to learn how to scale your business to giant proportions and scare the daylights out of all your competitors, 
just take the giant step of going to agentonfire.com. Listen to me. Focus. Go to agentonfire.com right now. Download. It is free. It is your arrow that will go right through the heart of any competitor. It's the free seven bullet points that you need to follow now in order to get a lot of listings, charge more money, not just survive this attack on our market, but thrive in it. Go to Agent on Fire right now, put in your information. It's just an email. Download the PDF, start using it, become the monster in your marketplace. Tune in next time and we'll talk about whatever hell else I think you need as ammo. Take care. This is the podcastfactory.com.